All right, families, we're going to get ready for baptisms in a few minutes. Continue to get your drinks and your food. Families that are getting baptized, please line up and we'll get you going in a couple minutes. The line is going to be on this side, on the pool side, and the entrance will be right over here. Forget my bearings, west side. Kennedy, Reagan, and Luke Atwell. Atwell, Kennedy, Reagan, and Luke Atwell. Crystal Rodriguez. All right, Crystal's coming out. This is, have her come in over here on this side. Uh, come on in. We're going to do her first. Everybody. We have Crystal Rodriguez here, and today she's getting baptized with us. And Crystal, quick to share with us a little, a little bit why you uh, want to get baptized today. Um, well, to make it short, I was in a really dark place in life, and um, I cried out to God, and I asked him why, why he left me, and if he could just take me home with him. I was just ready to go home, and then I was given a second chance, and so I guess this is me um, returning home to him. <laughs> wow. Crystal, we're so happy to have you here today. We're going to baptize you. So, Miss Jen, will you hold her? Will you put your hand on your nose? Okay. Right, there you go. All right. We're going to go straight back. We baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Yes. All right, Crystal, we're going to have you come out this way. Hey, good. I'm glad you're here. Thank you. This is off. Go to your. All right. At Wells? Who's ready over there? Malloy's? Why don't you come on forward? And Deb, you want to baptize Johnny? Are right, you want to share with us a little bit of Johnny's story? Do you have another microphone over there? Hello there. Son, my son, John, why do you want to be baptized, son? Because I want everybody to know I love Jesus and that we're going on five years. And we're going on five years as a family. So can you hold the mic, please? All right. I'm going to bend you down. I now baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. 
We have, we're going to pray at the end of our, our, uh, our baptisms, so if you're asking, we're play, praying at the end. We've got over, we got about 50 baptisms we're going to go through. We want to hear everybody's story. So Kimberly and Monty Malloy, will you share with us a little bit why you're getting baptized today? Oh, okay. Well, I've been putting it off for 20 years, and um, it's not, I'm not getting any younger. A little peer pressure from my wife. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's the Holy Spirit. Yeah, that's not. And not um, your wife. I've always waited to do it, or had the excuse to do it at the right time, at the oh, right cool. moment. Not very many people. Maybe Terry Powell doing my, doing it for me. And then uh, here I am in front of all this. So I guess God had another idea. So exciting, exciting, exciting. Yeah, and for me, it's just a rededication. This is a new chapter, a new chapter for us, new chapter for the church, and I'm all in. Awesome. Well, Dave and Jen, will you do us, help us out here as we get ready to baptize them? Additional. Additional. We got them. put up one in the middle. Gotcha, brother. Yep, yep, yep. Miss Grizel, why do you want to be baptized? Okay, let me know. <laughs> For a new beginning and a new life. Amen. He loves you. I did. All right, up next we have Bethany and Addie Russo. Today they're getting baptized together. Who's Bethany? Bethany, great name. Will you share with us a little bit why you guys are getting baptized today? And Addie, will you share with us too? I want everybody to know that I love Jesus and he loves me back. Amen. Woo! That's good. I just want everyone to know that I can't go throughout this life without Jesus by my side. Okay. Bethany and Addie with their profession of faith. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right. All right. All right. How are you, beautiful? And why do you want to be baptized? I just want everybody to know that I want to show my love to Jesus. And I want, when Jesus comes down, I want Jesus to remember that I got baptized and got a new life. Awesome! At this time, we got the Massonary family. Pastor Joey and his family are coming in for baptism. Try to do it the same. You and Gary, why don't you help me out together? Okay, just don't cover it. Just don't want to drop it. That one. 
this way? No. Yeah. Check, check. Just hold it up here. I just don't want to get him in the sun. Little check, check, and there we go. Fantastic. And Lindsay, come around front. That uh, as we, gosh, there's all kinds of people in here. We've got Pastor Joey, precious daughter, Lindsay, what we call the PHQ, Peyton, Harper, and Quinn. We have Salma and uh, Caitlin here, too, to help us out. And as you know, as I see the T-shirts, all things new, I just hearken back to um, the days at uh, the Hacienda. And that's when Lindsay was uh, just a little one, and she was actually dedicated uh, to the Lord there at uh, the Hacienda Hotel. And just as God continues to bless us all in every season of our lives, and as we do, uh, and move forward in all things new, that uh, to baptize everyone uh, here together. And that I know that, Lindsay, you wanted just to say a couple things? My family, and um, just I'm excited to extend my faith of my own with just this new change in our lives. Yeah. <laughs> Quinny, do you want to say, why do you want to be baptized, Quinny? You good? All right. Because we love Jesus, right? All right, let's do this in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Yes, yeah, so in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, uh, that we baptize again you all in the name of the Father, the Son. And we can do it right here. I know that uh, two, three, yes. And again, all things are new and that what God... Um, you know, we've been here, God has blessed us so many years at Cornerstone, and there's going to be so many, so many more years and so many more years on top of that. All right, so I'm going to give up the phone to uh, Pastor Gary Roca, what we call the Roca Meister. All right, we got, looks like we've got some family coming in here at Wells. And the kittle. Is Luke going to do this? <laughs> All right. All right, Luke, will you help us out here with, with all the names really quickly? We know who's getting baptized. Come on, microphone. My youngest aunt, granddaughter, Reagan, Sweet Kennedy. We got Bailey, Ashley, Dave. Dave, Dave baptized? Oh. And why are we getting baptized today? It's just to show more support for Joey and the church and to give our lives one more time to Jesus. That's exciting. All right, we're going to take you all one by one here. Would you, all, would you like to share really quick why you want to be baptized today? Yes. It's just, uh, Bailey hasn't been baptized before, and um, it's been a while for me, and we just are on a new chapter, so we want to give ourselves to the Lord. Woohoo! All right. Well, with your profession of faith, today we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yeah, all right.
All right, and over here we have Siler. He's a fifth grader. Can you tell everybody why you want to be baptized today? Look over here. I want to be baptized because I want to go with the Lord I once I go to heaven. Awesome, and you're letting everybody know how much you love Jesus, yes? Yes. All right. Might come out. Yeah. Or just towards the front. Maybe just go up there. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Dave. Who do we have up next here? Yeah, your name? Tom. Tom and Andy. Andy. Andy? What, what's your last name? Bowen. 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 Okay. So why are we getting baptized today? To further my relationship with the God, with Christ. Um. <laughs> No, it's time for a change. It's time to grow up and just get right with God. Love it. That's awesome. Wonderful family. So we're going to baptize you now if you guys have never been baptized. So here we go. This is great. And under the Las Vegas sun. Put your hands on your nose to help uh, make sure we're good. All right. With your profession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, yes. All right, All right. we got two here. Eric. Tell us why you want to be baptized. To reconnect with Jesus, to be born again. Right. To just, yeah, get a deeper connection in my faith. And uh, we wanted to do this together because we've been engaged. I just think it's the right right thing to do yes. together amen and let everybody know all right Scarlet, this is Scarlet. Yeah. You are ready, girlfriend. And your name? Sia. 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 Yeah. Sia. Why are you both getting baptized today? For Jesus, and I want to raise her in the right way, so I need to be here. Awesome! What a great new beginning of being baptized together, mom and daughter. All right. <laughs> All right. We ready? All right. We bapt uh, with your profession of faith. Faith. We baptize you in the name of the Father the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Woo! Nice! Oh, come here, come this way. All right, we have Miss Emily over here, which was John's kindergarten teacher. Now, if that's not awesome, I don't know what. Emily, tell us why you want to be baptized. Because I love Jesus, and I want to I want to live His will for my life, and not my own. Um, and I'm ready. He chose you, and I know you chose Him. God has some great things in store for you, sis. All right, at this time we have Ethan, Ethan La Lamontagne. It's a Lamontagne in the house. Like, wow. I want him to talk. Jerry and Leah's kid? He's got a story. All right. He's got a message. Will you share with us why you're getting baptized today, Ethan? Yeah, so um, I the only time I've ever gotten baptized was on a mission trip in Mexico, like six years ago. Uh, I've been having a lot of issues since then that I want to, that I've been trying to overcome and I'm just finally ready to go all in with that decision. And, oh. and I also, I also have a calling and a mission from God. And I think that the only way that I can do that, um, to the fullest extent is by, you know, going all in with God. So he has been, this is awesome. What a, what a great story and get testimony and excited for the next steps for you, Ethan. Well, and what's cool is at some point, I always say this, our parents' faith has to become our own faith. Yeah. And I think you can find, you can say, it's not your dad's faith anymore, is it? Yeah. It's yours, which is sick. 
Oh, Ethan. All right, Ethan, with your profession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Don't say it's cold. <laughs> All right. We have uh, Joe, Tammy Stafford, and Mason Stafford here getting baptized. And this is special. This is fun to, to be a part of. So will you guys share with me a little bit why you are getting baptized today? Mason, you want to go first? All right. So I thought about it long and hard. Pastor Joey was... Okay, so um, Tam and I are going to renew our marriage vows here on uh, our 25th, and the Lord kind of spoke to me and said, you know, maybe it's time to renew your baptism with me, and that really spoke to me. A lot of you know that um, I've been with Pastor Greg since 1977. I was on the original board with him, and now I just have the blessing and the honor to be with uh, Joey and on the board, and I just thought this is a perfect time to uh, rededicate my life in baptism to Jesus. Amen, Joe. Yeah. All right. So um, originally, when I chose baptism for myself, it was like '99. Oh my goodness! And uh, I got baptized with Cole and Sean, and that was um, right here at Cornerstone. And originally, when I decided to choose baptism again this time, I was doing it to support Mason. But I realized today. When Pastor Tim was talking, that over this past summer with some of the things that I've been through, I have allowed my natural family and my circumstances to tell me that I am someone other than who I have grown to be and a child of God. And so this is just a great uh, time to wash that away and be renewed. Yeah. I just wanted to get uh, baptized with my nana and papa because I haven't got baptized before. There you go. <laughs> right on. Well, Mason, Joe, and Tammy, <laughs> love you guys. And today, with uh, with because of your profession of faith, today you get baptized in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right. Justin Arnold, will you help me here, buddy, with the name of your children? Uh, Bailey, Brayden, and Holden, my three oldest. Three oldest. And today, today you're baptizing them. Yeah, I was going to ask, actually, if you guys would baptize me first. Wow. And then I'll do that. We're going to baptize Papa Justin here first. Yeah. Why do you want to get baptized today, Justin? Uh, well, I got baptized when I was a kid, probably 10 to 12, somewhere in there. Um, but whole lot's changed since then. This was a real tough year for me and uh, my faith. And I um, had some medical stuff. My back, I had a really bad back. And God's kind of delivered me from that. So I, I feel like I just need a rededication for, with that. And then I'm just trying to raise them yeah. as best I can. Yeah. Justin, you're a great man. And I'm, we're excited for you to be baptized today with your children. So with your profession of faith, Justin, we baptize you in the name of the Father, 
the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, kiddos, why are we getting baptized today? I want to accept Jesus into my heart and. Perfect. I don't know what to do. You say I know what to do? You believe in Jesus? All right, then we're good. We're ready to get baptized. And. I know Sean over there is going to baptize his kids in a minute, and Justin, I was encouraging you. But as dads, I thought it would be cool to say, why don't we baptize our own kids? Why don't we lead our own kids? Why don't we lead our own house? And so you're an amazing father. You are an amazing father. I just felt like that was like a word for you this year, that, that you need to hear that publicly. Like, you are an amazing father. <laughs> that's it. That's, that's my word. <laughs> And as we baptize these kids, you're fathering the way God has told us to father. You're leading your home the way God, God has a design for marriage. He has a design for kids. He has a design for family. And, and you are living that design. So, and you're doing a good job. So that's it. But All right, all right, kiddos, with your profession of faith. Braden, with your profession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Right. All right, Braden. All right, Holden. The profession of faith. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Bailey, Miss Bailey. All right, Miss Bailey. We baptize you today. Before your profession of faith, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. All right, everybody, this is Everett Stafford here. This is my, my second youngest son. Um, I'm just blessed and honored to uh, see him wanting to follow the Lord with all his life. So uh, why do you want to be baptized today, Everett? Because I want everybody to know that I love Jesus. Amen, amen, amen. All right. Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Welcome to New York, Right. This is my oldest daughter, Avery Stafford. And again, just such a blessing and an honor to just see my kiddos put their faith, their trust, and, and just love Jesus with all of their hearts. So, Avery, why do you want to be baptized today? Because I want to show everybody that I love Jesus. Amen, amen. All right. And he loves you. Pastor Joey is going to lead us here at this next baptism. A very special young man. He woke up today and said, I want to be baptized, Mom. And uh, this is our ne my nephew, Stetson Massonary. He loves the Lord. And uh, this is his Papa Evan and his Papa G. Or, wait, yes, kind of. Yeah, you are. Pop Papa Evan, Papa G. So I thought, could we have the two Papas baptize this young man? Stetson, why is it you want to be baptized? Do you want to tell us? Because God said to. Because God said to. God said to. That's right. That's, and we love Jesus. That's awesome. God said to. Stetson, because your confession of faith and your love for the Lord and your love of Jesus, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. 
All right. Let's jump over that one. All right. Over here we have Miss Linda and Eddie. Give it up for them. So awesome. And why is it you want to be baptized? I'm here to testify it's never too late. I'm in my 70s, Woo! and I just found Christ this past few years. Yeah. Hallelujah! Glory! You. All right. Come on, uh, I've been baptized before in the Pacific Ocean, in San Pedro, and once again in Redondo Beach. But I've been with this church for four months, and I'm ready to get baptized one more time. Amen. <laughs> Well, we have a wonderful couple that has been a huge part of our lives at church here for 13, 14 years. Your beautiful daughter, Maddie. Now we get to be called family. Um, but goodness, 20, 2008 or 9, we met you guys. And I thought, too, you guys are like two of my best friends ever. You left in 2010, and this guy showed up in 2010. So that's funny. Cool. Funny how we look alike. Yeah. <laughs> that is. So Evan and Vanessa, Vanessa, Mama Ford, why is it you guys want to be baptized? Um, for me, I, if I'm being honest, I feel like my faith could be a little stale. I got baptized when I was 10, and you just get in the, you know, you, you do the, the thing. You read your Bible, and you pray, and then you go do, your, you know, and it's like kind of just a fresh start. Like, you know what? It needs to be about Jesus, not the routine. So. Uh, for me, I don't remember doing it when I was younger. I know I did, because um, I asked, I actually called my mom this week, and she said you did when you were younger. Um so just out of obedience to God. But another reason is how important this day is to all of us in a spiritual stand against the enemy and any spirits that are trying to keep Pastor Joey from doing anything that is in God's will. So if we can just lift this day up to him as another day of, uh, of, of standing against the enemy and anything he's got against him. All right? Well, Evan and Vanessa, because of your love of the Lord, we've watched you raise all your kids, and now you're the world's youngest grandparents and best-looking grandparents. <laughs> because of your confession of faith, we're going to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Test. Oh, of course. <laughs> Dustin, Dustin, why do you want to be baptized? I'm uh, 26 years old, and unfortunately, I have not been baptized yet. Um, moved across the country from Alaska, moved my family here, started a new foundation, and I really wanted to do that for me and my family. Awesome. All right, we're going to baptize. All right, this afternoon we have, oh, oh we got another one. One there. more. There's another one. Yes. Tell us your name and why you want to be baptized. My name is Carter, and I want to be baptized because I love God. Yes. All right, Carrie, how you doing today? You're here to be baptized. It's, it's been like 10 years since I've seen you. Maybe 12, 14. But why are we getting baptized today, Carrie? Okay. 
Um, my mom passed away 15 years ago, and I have been running from God ever since. And I came back on our 15th anniversary of her death to my sister, and I'm back, and I want to be cleansed and walk for God and do what his will is in my life. That's awesome. Anything else? of faith in Christ Jesus, unashamedness, your return to walking in his grace and his presence, and I want you to know that that is one of the most wonderful things as pastors we get to see is those who come home, and you're always welcome with arms wide open. We love you. Because of your faith, we're going to baptize you and recommit your life to the Lord. And I hear that there might be a habit or two that you want to toss out the window. <laughs> that uh, I, I don't know anything about that, but if any humor filters through, we'll yeah, make sure we... we okay. <laughs> but we want to baptize you in the renew In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Awesome. We have Angelique over here. This touched my heart. Why do you want to be baptized? Um, I kind of grew up in the church, and I had a tough season in my life that kind of pulled me away. Um, so I'm kind of just ready to get, come back. She ready to come back, y'all. These are some Hall of Famers, some Hall of Famers in the house. Well, Jessica and So we have some, some Hall of Famers in the house, Martin and Jean Gavin, heroes, heroes of Cornerstone, Hall of Famers. And uh, Martin, would you introduce your family here? Yes, our niece, Jessica, and her children, Taylor and Trey. We're asking God to bless them this day. Well, you guys have a rich spiritual history of some heroes. And I don't, we don't say that all the time, but these two are heroes. His love for Christ is so evident. Her love for Christ is evident. Um, and it's, it's even so much greater than all of his amazing tap dancing. We love these guys. It's a, that's a lot of talent, right? Um, well, my goodness. Well, what, do you guys want to say anything before we baptize? Say something. Yeah, so my aunt and uncle have been bringing me to this church since I was about their age. And, and every time I come in this building, it just fills my spirit. And I cry every single <laughs> service. And it's not, it's just out of overwhelming love for God. And I've been waiting to do this for way too long because I accepted Christ into my life when I was about seven years old. And to be able to do this with my kids today is absolutely a dream come true. Amazing. Martin, Jean, when we're done, we'll stick around. Let's have you pray over these guys, all right? Well, because as a family, David, j jump in here. Maybe let's get David and Jennifer on this one here. Or No, you, you, you take them. Jen, you go in the middle because okay. the mic is going to get wet. Because of your confession of faith, family, we baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amazing. You guys can take over over there, but would you guys come? Could we pray for these guys? And let's have a word. Of, let's come forward, or yeah, get a photo. But let's pray with the family here. You guys can take over. Martin, you want to pray? Or do you yes. want to pray over these guys? Thank you, Jesus, for this precious family. Jessica's been wanting to do this for over 11 years, and this is the day the Lord has made, and we came to rejoice in it. And we just pray that you'll anoint them and fill them with your Holy Spirit yes, and sir. give them all the joy and uh, the path that you have for them, Father, and for this whole family, I pray in Jesus' name. Jesus. Thank you. Amen. 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 
Amen. Over here we have my new friend Gordon. Give it up for Gordon. All right. Tell us why you want to be baptized. Uh, I've never been baptized before, and there's this is like the best place to do it, so mine as well. You love Jesus? Absolutely. He loves you. All right. All right, all right. Do we have everybody that signed up? Have they all gone through? Have they come through? I would like to open it up for, for those who have not been baptized or didn't come thinking they were going to get baptized. We want to open it up for, for you to be baptized today. You'll go home wet, but it'll be okay. We'll get you a shirt later on. If I could have the attention, um, and I, I'm going to call some people out that have been baptized because we've never baptized this many people before, uh, Kimberly, this concerns Kimberly, over here, over here, over here. We want to ask those that we didn't have the opportunity to pray with. We didn't realize in trying to do so many, we didn't actually get to lay hands on everybody and pray for them. So if you were not prayed for and would like to do so, we would love to do so. So come on over. We're not going to put you back in the water. But if you'd like prayer, we want to be here for that. So God bless you guys. Oh, no, he gave it to me. I give you this or should I give you
mic for you. Two more. Kavika, Tori. Come on, Kavika, Tori. Tori and Kavika. All right. You got it. Good job. So guys, we have one more, actually two more. Tell me your names and why you guys want to be baptized today. It's your fault. I'm Kavika and I want to be baptized because I love God. Amen. I'm Tori and um, I've <laughs> never been baptized and I want to give my life to the Lord. Yeah. Awesome. So I'm going to hold this down. So because of your commitment, we want to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. 